Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Recently we have informed our viewers that MOD has accorded approval in principle for light weight tank funded under make one category on 3rd March which means government will pay for at least 70% of the prototype development. The front runner in the light tank development is a tank being developed by LNT and DRDO. In a recent interview with Business World, DRDO Chief G. Satish Reddy said that the light tank project is taken up by DRDO. We have already designed and we are developing the prototype now. The light tank should be ready very soon. Now, as we have reported multiple times, DRDO, CVRD and LNT has already started working on light weight tank. They have already started procuring armor steel and other systems and tools for the program which we can find from the multiple tenders issued this year. Initially, the plan was to use existing K9 Bajra chases and replace this 155mm gun with a 105mm gun to reduce its overall weight. But it seems this plan hasn't dropped now. CVRD is going ahead with chases of NGMBT. Though this was designed initially for Indian Army FRCV program, CVRD seems to be reusing the same design for light tank which seems to be right segue for the development. The tank will be capable of firing multiple munitions with 105mm main gun and 7.62mm coaxial machine gun as a secondary weapon. It will offer the protection level of NATO STNAG 4569 level 4. One of the unique features of this design is three-member crew configuration located at the frontal portion of the hull which has maximum protection. This will increase the amount of passive, composite and reactive armor protection required for the crew. The light tank will be powered by a high altitude operable power pack capable of delivering 1000 horsepower. Looking at the present progress made by CBRD on lightweight tanks, we can expect the first prototype of tank pretty soon coming out between 2023-24 followed by its trial. The production of tanks may start by 2027 itself. Now, talking about the requirement of lightweight tank, in April 2021, Indian Ministry of Defense had issued an official RFI for the phased purchase of next generation 350 light tanks under Make in India scheme of DAP 2020. The requirement of light tank was felt after China fielded its light tank Type 15 during the standoff in Ladakh. The combat weight of tanks, that is the weight of fully loaded tank, should not exceed 25 tons with modular and upgradable main gun, secondary armament for anti-air and ground roles with different caliber and assisted via remote weapon station. It should also fire modern advanced multi-purpose smart munitions with gun, tube-launched anti-tank guided missiles and able to defeat tanks, A vehicles, UAVs and soft-skinned vehicles and PGMs. It should have a stenag level protection from all sides including top. It must have explosive reactive armor, soft kill measures, CVRN protection and instant fire detection and support. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and jai hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.